gonna go into mommy's doctor's appointment? Oh, you can't go in now. You're gonna have to stay here all by yourself. Okay, I have my shoe on. Okay, get your shoe on. Let's get your other one on. No. Why are I taking a nap? No, we're going out. Let's get out. Want to get out? Okay. Okay, get it. Okay, we are headed into my 31 week doctor's appointment. <laughs> the Grant Tamer. Yeah, Ryan came today because last time I went, Grant was literally hanging off of the hospital bed and like broke the stirrup and it was a whole thing. Ryan's gonna come to tame the beast because he is, he can be a monster. So we're gonna go in there and then I guess we're not gonna go to Tractor Supply because he's not gonna be good. Yeah. Okay, so. All right, let's go. Okay, let's go. Okay, let's go. Do, working on oh, something. It was not fun. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's jelly. Not the kind you eat though. <laughs> not the kind in your donut. It's not peanut jelly, don't worry. Hey guys, I want to share with you just a little bit of an update with the addition. Super exciting things. It is coming along and I wanted to share with you what it's done so far. It's going to look so different the next uh, clip that I film after this one because it is just like, I can't believe how far it's come in like just a couple weeks and by next week it's going to look spectacular. Okay, so it's probably gonna be kinda hard to tell because um, it's daylight, so you might not even notice like the lights, but um, we got all the recessed lighting put in. This hallway still has to be completely finished. We have to spackle, and um, spackling has already started, but we have to finish the spackling, and then we can get it painted in the ceiling, all painted, it needs to be primed, everything. So anyway, um, Stella's room, is all completely painted ceilings are done so she has the recessed lighting as well but we're actually gonna put them on a dimmer switch because last night we came out and we put them on and they were so bright because it is a pretty small room so we're gonna put it on a dimmer switch uh, we got her wallpaper up which I am absolutely obsessed with uh, we're gonna put board and batten on the other part of the wall and it's gonna be pink and it's just gonna look so pretty with her crib like i can already i can envision it so <laughs> that is that um walking in this way so this is our bedroom and you can turn the recess lighting on is here and it is on a dimmer switch already so like see the difference you can turn it all the way down or all the way up um our room is all painted <clears throat> i think we need to just touch up a couple little spots but the paint color in this room is Pale Oak by Benjamin Moore, and the paint color in Stella's room is Agreeable Gray. The paint colors are so, so similar, but um, this is just a little bit more warmer toned. It's a little less gray and a little bit more beige, which I love it so much. It's like my new favorite paint color. It's bright, but it's still warm, and I think it'll be nice and easy to keep clean. So uh, we still have to finish all the window trim um the casings for around the window whatever so we got to do that but i just love my giant windows in here the lighting is so good um i love that i can see the swing set from here i can see grant's dirt pile right there or if i look out so bright if you look out this window you can see his dirt pile so like i can see anywhere he's playing in the backyard <laughs> um and then i went with a dark dark green in here i don't oh the color is right here let's see 
The color is Pristine Wilderness. It is a Sherwin-Williams color, but I got it mixed in the Valspar just because it's cheaper. Um, and I got it in satin. So there is that wall. I wanted like a dark, deep wall. And here's like a better, I don't know, there, that's a better like representation of the color. It's like the perfect green. And green is like my favorite. So we have a double switch here, which is perfect for when I get out of bed. I can turn the lights on and off. This one will turn on the recess lighting. See? And then uh, this one turns on these lights, which I am totally obsessed with. They're gonna look so perfect above our bed. I'm gonna put our big picture in the middle and it's just gonna look so, so good. I cannot wait. Um, so what's next? Uh, next up, we're gonna be working on the board and batten wall. I think we're gonna finish this hallway. Ryan's gotta finish the door frames. He actually had to like build these by himself. Uh, maybe not that one, but this one, like he's working on building uh, the door casings because we had to remake them. So working on that. Um, so we have to finish, uh, all the baseboards need to be put down. Um, so we're going to get those done. I have, they're already primed. So I just have to semi gloss them and then we can nail them up on the wall. And then after that I can go through and just cover the nail holes and paint over that. So, um, and then this is like the worst room of all. You can't see in it right now cause I don't have the light on. We have to actually move the switch. Uh, this used to be Grant's bedroom. And so it's going to have a pocket door and this is going to be our walk-in closet. We are going to have a huge walk-in closet. I am so excited, but we have to finish it still. So that all has to get sanded and probably my guess is another coat. I don't know. I feel like it's a closet, so I don't want it. It doesn't need to be perfect. This is all going to be shelving anyway. So it just seems silly to make it super perfect. But um, there's our bedroom door. There's Stella's uh, closet door. Here is the pocket door. So I stained them all just like the rest of the house. So all the doors in the house are matching. Um, we're going to put rods and shelving all up. We're going to do it all hand built instead of like those wire shelving. I hate that so much. Uh, we kept this just normal light in here. It's perfect. It's a good brightness. Took the window out because we don't need a window in the closet and that could be all shelving there. So, uh, yeah, it's coming along. It is <laughs> slowly, but surely, but carpet people come on Wednesday of next week. So we have just under a week to really get this buttoned up so that way we can get carpet put in and then honestly that's it guys we can get moved in here which i'm very excited about let's just take another look at this wallpaper because it is literally beautiful i got this from home depot i just typed in rose wallpaper and this is what came up and i was like it is perfect so perfect if you didn't know stella's middle name is rose so I kind of wanted to go off of that. So anyway, I'm very excited. It has been a bit since I pulled out the camera. I did not pull it out yesterday and yesterday was my shower. So if you're wondering what that mess behind me is, it's because I had my baby shower. Um, I do want to share like some stuff that I got, but it's really hard for me to like pull everything out right now because Stella's nursery is not done. So that is what we're working on the next few days. I am getting over a cold. Um, we had croup in our house, uh, Paisley and Weston had like a fever for a day and then a cough. Um, but Grant had it the worst obviously because he's old, uh, younger. And then Ryan and I just had like cold symptoms. So, uh, we are getting over that. Grant is on the mend. He is on a liquid steroid, um, to help with that. And he has one more day tonight to take it and then he's done. He only had to take it for three days. There's so much noise going on because Ryan's working out in the edition. So I want to give a little update. I had talked about it before in the vlog. I don't know if that's going to be combined with this one. It's just been really hectic trying to get this done. We're on a time crunch. I am 32 weeks pregnant. I think, I don't even know. I'm losing track because it's just, it's been hard to like focus on anything because we're just literally every day working in this edition trying to get it done but it is coming along it looks so good um yesterday he got the trim up yes i'm 32 weeks pregnant 
<laughs> but yesterday he got the trim up so that looks really good um but i just put paint clothes on i'm just in like an old t-shirt um that still will fit the bump and painting pants because we have work to get done it is sunday um i've got a meal in the crock pot and i'm gonna leave this recipe in the links down below um i have to go cook up a little bacon quick before i start painting because i'm making a it's technically a ham and potato soup but i'm gonna do bacon and potato because we did not ham, have ham so um yeah i am gonna make my bed even though the rest of my room is a complete disaster um just because it is filled with the baby stuff that we received yesterday from our shower um if you did send me a gift off my registry on amazon or target Thank you guys so much. I was not expecting it and a few of you sent me some things and it was just, it was okay, the So this is what my room looks like right now. Like this is just the section that I'm, I can't even go through yet because um, we don't have a nursery. Um, it is almost finished. Carpet comes Wednesday and after carpet's in, I just have to touch up the baseboards and then literally is that what they're called baseboards yeah i think so <laughs> and then literally we can put everything in i can get her crib up we can put her dresser in there and i can go through all of this stuff this is what my room looks like right now and i'm just kind of ignoring it and just pretending it's not even there because if i look at it it just gives me anxiety but this is just what has to happen for the next few days and then it will all be taken care of okay, so we got the trim up around this door frame now we have to touch up paint. We have to paint, uh, fill in all like the holes. If you look at the trim, like it has nail holes. So we have to fill all those in, paint this. And this is the hallway. The hallway is getting sanded today and hopefully painted and that will be complete. We did get the floor in. So this is the transition strip that Ryan made. And then the floor just goes all throughout. It's so filthy right now, obviously. Um, and then here is her wall where I'm hoping the crib will fit. I don't know, I haven't like mapped out in my head where I'm even gonna put furniture. I still have to figure that out, hoping that I get it figured out sooner than later. <laughs> um, we're gonna be putting her closet door on as soon as the carpet is put in. Ryan is going to be, I think on Thursday and Friday, doing the closets, like we have shelving we wanna put in those, and rods and whatnot, but we got all of her trim up, and like see the trim all around the floor. That is all up. Uh, her pink board and batten wall has to be touched up and the top board has to be painted. Uh, we just haven't gotten to that yet, so we're probably going to do that today. We're just trying to button everything up, do all the finishing touches. I did go through and stain all of the windows, just like they are in the rest of the house. And then the trim is all painted white. It looks so good. I love how it pops. But then in our bedroom, let me turn the light on. We have the space heater on right now because the heating company hasn't come yet. These windows, so all these windows are finished. I do have to get blinds for all the windows, which uh, I'm dreading because blinds are not cheap. Um, so I have to get those just for you know privacy reasons and stuff. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna put curtains up in here just because the trim is so close to the wall on both sides. So let me know what you guys think. I am almost thinking I might just do the white wooden blinds to cover up the windows. Um, and then our nightstands are gonna be below each window with our bed in the middle. So if you can envision that, but these lights are my absolute favorite. Oops. That is how they look on. Are, are you looking around? Hi. Now it looks so good. I am very happy and after Wednesday you guys it's gonna look so so different I know you love the lights but don't play with them hey hey don't play with them please